there. It is a gorgeous display that Yulia has brought uh, us today. And I want to be able to say Merry Christmas to all of you celebrating the Ukrainian Christmas, but I tried to figure out how to say it and I can't. Yulia? Say it one more time. Okay. I meant to say that. Uh, and uh, <laughs> it's, a big, it's a big night tonight uh, and into tomorrow. So what happens yeah. for Ukrainian Christmas? So for us, uh, we're going by the Julian uh, calendar. So our Christmas is a little bit later than uh, regular Canadian Christmas. And 45 days before January 6, we actually start fasting. We eat no meat, no dairy products. So all the dishes usually are vegetarian. And tonight is our last vegetarian meal. And that's what we usually have. So of course, there are vegetarian pierogies. Uh, we have vegetarian cabbage rolls on the table with uh, rice and mushroom or buckwheat and mushrooms. We also have some crepes. And here we have uh, cabbage stew that's also vegetarian. Traditional we'll eat with meat, but tonight it's without meat. Speaking of uh, yeah, the, without the meat, you have fish. So you've yeah, been doing this a, uh, for 45 days now. <laughs> are, you, are you tired well, of fish? <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> You're okay. Well, and uh, this is so we eat fish, and this is vegetarian salad uh, from uh, with beets. And here we have a buckwheat or kasha. We eat a lot of grain during those 45 days of fasting. And here we have uh, dry fruits because we we also not supposed to drink alcohol, so we make our own homemade juice from dry fruits. So we boil it, and then that's what we drink for sweet something. And here we have uh, kutia. This is a, a very typical traditional dish. It's all with grain to represent the new life because uh, Jesus uh, Christ was born. So we eat that. It's very traditional. And of course, one, uh, one of the main breads is uh, over Yes, here. there's a story behind this, right? Yeah. So this is um, a, a holiday bread for uh, Ukrainians. It's, uh, it's a shape. It's a round shape because it's the sun. And we used to have, we tend to have this tree on the table to represent the Trinity on Christmas Eve. So would this likely be the centerpiece? Then? Yeah, this is like the centerpiece. Piece, yeah. And so what is inside? Is it so this is more like an egg bread, and we can have it with, with raisins or without. And in in our family, we like it with raisins. Yeah. So we so. like how it's like a challah. Yeah. yeah, it's very similar to challah. Very yeah. similar to challah. That is the yeah. biggest challah I've ever seen. Oh yeah. <laughs> that is unbelievable. So this is uh, quite the spread that you have. And so tonight there'll be a big festive meal. Yeah. Made up mostly of these types of items, yeah. and then everything will switch over tomorrow as yeah, you head tomorrow, into your Christmas yeah. day yeah. and yeah. bring out the meat. Yeah. Tomorrow I like it even better. Because because tomorrow is the day when we actually have our turkey. We will be allowed to eat uh, meat, so we're going to have our turkey. And also, if uh, we have uh, godparents, the kids usually go to godparents' house and they receive gifts, gifts from them. So it's uh, even a greater there for gift for the kids tomorrow, so to receive gift. It's wonderful to see. <laughs> and I was asking, because you guys are located right behind the IKEA. Yeah, the, the new IKEA, yeah. How is, that, how is that going? Because you were saying, too, it's been really incredibly busy for you the last, yeah. you know, at least week as people are getting ready for this meal. Yeah, oh, it's, it's very busy right now. We have very happy about our new neighbors, uh, the new IKEA. So it's been uh, busy, especially over the new year. And right now. So people run over for the meatballs over at IKEA, and then yeah. they swing by and they pick up the pierogies oh, yeah. from you yeah, guys. Are you finding that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what are you most looking forward to? Or for you, what is the dish that takes the, you know, that's made with tender, loving care as yeah. you prepare for these meals? Well, it's, of course, our pierogies. We have 15 uh, flavors of cooked frozen pierogies in the store. So it's already from the vegetarian to meat to dessert kind. And we actually launched a new line uh, back in April, which is where we sell our raw pierogies. And there are 12 kinds of those. So altogether, we have close to 30 different flavors of pierogies in our store. That is amazing. And, yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. Now, there's no, usually we usually have them with sour cream. Oh, yeah. Because of the way the meal is designed with the dairy, there's no sour cream with this. And I, I don't know. Zach, can you just pan over? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> You're just yeah. standing there waiting to dig in. So for you, uh, for you where, where do you crave? I, 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 uh, the pierogies, I love yeah. pierogies, yeah. the cabbage rolls. Yeah. yeah. Oh, the yeah. cabbage rolls. We actually have six kinds of cabbage rolls in our store. Yeah. So we, uh, we have some meat and vegetarian cabbage rolls, and they also, you can get them either like that, you can eat right away, or you can get them cooked frozen. All you have to do, just come home and put it in the microwave. That's a big part yeah. of your business, eh? People yeah. coming in and getting the, the pierogies and cabbage well, rolls yeah. that way, right? Think, yes. Yeah. Think about how labor intensive these are. I mean, we all love, you know, being able, they're like a treat for us, but think about how labor intensive in terms of, you know, mm -hmm. Cabbage rolls, pierogies. You're, you're starting everything from scratch, right? With the, yeah. the fresh yeah. crepes. That looks good to me too. Yeah, it's vegetarian beet salad. Is one of beet the most salad. popular in yeah. our store. I'll help you. Yeah. Happy birthday. <laughs> All right, sure. thanks. Yeah. Thanks. I'm going to try I'm the going, beets. You want pro, you want beets? I want to try the beets out. Uh, you can find out uh, more information at uh, pierogi.ca. And okay, say it one more time. I'm going to try to do this. Sridzvom Hrstovom. Sridzvom Hrstovom. Hrstovom. Yeah. 
Is it Something like yeah, that. Yeah, Merry Christmas, too, and uh, to all of you celebrating a new Christmas. Can I dig in now? Oh, I'm yeah, digging sure. in. I'm going in for the program. Oh, yeah, go all right, we're going to take a uh, short commercial break, uh, and we're going to be back. Still plenty more to come right after this. Oh, 